Hey guys, Bubba Ricks here with another video and today what I have for you guys is another microfire mock and this one is a custom Obi-Wan's Jedi Interceptor. Now this is based entirely upon my Anakin's Jedi Interceptor mock. If you have already, make sure to check it out. I'll leave a card right here. And um, the design I think has turned out really great, so I decided to basically just uh, copy and paste that with this mock. It, there are a couple exceptions, such as those and things I'll show later on. But without further ado, let's get into this show. Starting off with this mock, you can see in the front, it does have like those curved in pieces resembling that with the actual Jai Interceptor. And then R4, of course, in the cockpit with the uh, Republic symbol that you can see over here. I don't have R4 in here because I had to take the droid out to use the head for this microfire. But, um, and then over here you can see just kind of some gray tiles representing that over here. And the wings, of course. These wings I actually do like much better than my Anakin's Dry Interceptor mock because they do have that curved in uh, look to the sides that you can see with the wings right here. But the one bummer with both of the Anakin's Dry Interceptor and this one is that they cannot fold in. And that's one thing I really wish I could have fixed, but using the hinges that I did, it's not possible to do so. But then we have the cannons in the front, which you can see over there, and the, um, I guess you could say, a ventilation in the back, which is there. It is in a different color, but I've just seen some pieces of fill in that, so I just threw in some vents. And you can see kind of a cheese slope right here, as well as over here, if I can get over there. I'm sorry, it's the lighting is really bad right now. You can see both of those right there. And then the cockpit does curve in, much like over here. And one thing is these, both Anakin's and this do not actually have the boosters on the back, which is one thing I wish I could have added. And then of course we have the cockpit with some gray tiles on the side to kind of make it more enclosed around Obi-Wan. And one other thing that I wish I could have done a little bit differently is you can see Obi-Wan just barely fits in this cockpit thing. His legs are just right at the edge of being exposed. And this has been done in some microfires, I want to say, in the, um, actually I can't think of one at the moment, but I know it has been done, I think in the one that came out this year, Anakin's Jedi, uh, I mean, Anakin's Naboo Starfighter set, that one, I'm pretty sure the main figure is pretty exposed, but nothing much more to say about this mock, I guess one little thing that you could do is raise these wings up, they do have those, like, uh, joint pieces so that you can move them at different levels, but it's nothing to it, This isn't accurate to the movie So I have them curved down like so that gives it a much more accurate look to the actual film But without further ado, let's get into the 360 of this mall. So there you guys have it, my custom Obi-Wan's Jedi Interceptor mock. I'm a huge fan of the Jedi Interceptor, it being one of my favorite Star Wars vehicles. I think that this microfire does a great job of representing that, and I'm really proud that it was turned out. Make sure to tell me what you guys think about this mock in the comment section below, and like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so that you won't miss any of my videos, and follow me on Instagram at Bobo Bricks. I'll see you guys next time, and have a great day. Bye.